Good morning, friends. I'm Shweta, and welcome to the Maths class of Standard Three. Today, I'm going to start chapter number two, that is addition. So, you all are very much familiar with this word addition. What is addition? When we are having two sets of number, and we want to combine that numbers, want to find out that in total how many numbers are all together then we use to perform this operation addition okay so in this chapter first we will learn to add two numbers by three different ways first is by breaking one number okay suppose two sets of number we are having in this we have to break one number and after that we will add the both the numbers the second part is by breaking both the numbers in this what we have to do we have to break both the numbers and after that we have to combine the numbers okay and the third way is counting in tens Okay, so let us start with the first way that is breaking one number. So, as you can see, I have written here two different numbers. Okay, and in between I have given plus sign. This is the sign of addition. If we want to add two numbers, then we have to give this sign. This is plus sign. Okay, so in this, what we have to do? We are using breaking by one numbers. We are adding two numbers by breaking one numbers. Okay, so first we have to choose that which number we will break. So we are breaking this number. Okay, so if we are breaking this number, so we have to write this number as it is. Means sixty three. Okay, now we have to give the sign plus. Now we have to break this number. First we will give a bracket and after that we will break this number. So as you can see that this number is having two digits. One is placed at ones position and second one is placed at tens position. So as here we can see two number is placed at tens position. So how many tens are there? See how many tens are there? Yes, two tens. Two tens is equal to one ten is equal to ten. Two ten is equal to very good twenty. Okay, two tens is equal to twenty. Okay, and how many ones are there? Four ones. So we have to give again the plus sign and four ones. Okay, then we have to close this bracket. Now we have break this number to ones and tens. How many ones are there? Four. How many tens are there? Two tens. Twenty. Okay. What we have to do after that? We have to add the sixty-three with this twenty. Why? Because both are having two digits number. Okay, and four is having one digit number. So first we will add sixty-three with twenty. Okay, so sixty-three plus twenty, and then we have to put this number in the bracket because whatever things we are going to write in the bracket. We have to solve that problem first, and after that we have to add four number. Okay, now sixty-three plus twenty. So first we will check ones position. Ones, how many ones are there? Zero. How many ones are there? Three. Three plus zero is equal to very good. 
थ्री ओके एंड आफ्टर दैट वी हैव टू चेक फॉर द टेंस प्लेस How many tens are there? Six. How many tens are there? Two. So if we will add this two with the six, means how many all together? How many tens are there? Six plus two, eight tens. Now we have added these two number. Successfully, eighty-three. After that, which number we have to add? This four plus four. Okay. So, as we can see, this is having one digit, which is placed at ones position. So, this four we have to add with eight number. Or with three number, think this is placed at ones place, ones position, and eight is placed at tens position, and three is placed at ones position. Very good. So here we have to add this four with this three. So four plus three is equal to very good seven, and after that. As only eight is written there, we cannot find any digit placed at tens position here. So we have to write this eight as it is. So this is the way to add two numbers by breaking one number. You can pause this video and write down in your copy. Now we are going to learn by breaking both the numbers. Addition by breaking both the numbers means the same number I have taken here, sixty-four and twenty-four. We have to add these number by breaking both the number. So first, what we have to do? We have to add. We have to break both the number. Sixty-four. How many tens are there? Very good. Six tens is equal to. Sixty. Okay. Then how many ones are there? Four plus four. So sixty plus four is bricked. Now, okay, sixty-four is bricked to sixty plus four. After that, what we have to do? We have to again break this number, twenty-four, like we have earlier. Did. So twenty. Plus four. Okay. Now what we have to do? This we have break the number. Both the number is now break. Okay. Now what we have to do? We have to add. How we will add? First, we have to check the two digits number. This is having two digits. This is having two digits. So first we will add sixty. Plus twenty. Okay, and after that we have to here add four plus four. Okay, four ones place four ones place four plus four. Okay, here again we have to give additions. Means this sixty four is break to sixty plus four, and twenty four is break to twenty plus four. Now we have to add two digits number all together and one digit number all together. So what we will get? Six ten plus two ten. Six plus two eight zero eighty because. It is having only six tens. It is only only having two tens. That's why eighty plus. Now we have to add this four plus four. Four plus four is equal to very good eight. Okay. Now we have to add 
these numbers. So, this 8 is placed at 1's position. So, 8 plus 0. 0 is also placed at 1's position. 8 plus 0 is equal to 8. And after that, here we cannot see any digit which is placed at 10's position. So, we have to write this 8 as it is. So, by this way, we can add two numbers. This is the way by breaking both the numbers. You can pause this video and copy these things in your maths copy. Now, the third way of addition is counting in tens. Okay? In this, what we have to do? We have to break the second number into tens. And then we have to add that tens to the first number. Like what we have to do? We have to write this first digit as it is. Okay? Plus. Now the second digit we have to break this second digit to tens. How many tens are there? Two tens. So first we will write one ten. Then second ten. How many tens are there? Two tens. Two ten I have written. Okay. And after that, how many ones are there? Four ones. Okay. Now what we have to do? We have to add this number by counting in tens. So how we will count in tens? Sixty-four. How many tens are there? Six tens. Then we have to add this one ten to the 64 number. Okay? 6 tens plus 1 ten. How many tens? 7 tens plus 4 ones. Okay? Then after this 10 digit we have added here. 74. Now we have to add this 10 plus 4. Okay? Now Again what we have to do? We have to add this 10 with this number. Okay? Once, one 10 we have already added here. Now the second 10 we, are, we have to add. So 7 10 plus 1 10 is equal to 8 10s. Very good. And then 4 because 4 is placed at one's position. Okay? Here, one ten we already have added here. Now, which number is left? Only four. Now, we have to add this four with this four. So, four plus four because both are placed at one's position. Four plus four is equal to 8 and after that only 8 because at the tens position nothing is there. So here we have added this. Okay. So this is the third way to add the numbers. You can pause this video and write this in your copy.